U.S. Secretary of Health and Human Services Javier Becerra will be in San Diego tomorrow as part of a health tour focusing on Latinos. As CBS 8's Jenny Day shows us, the secretary wants to highlight what the Biden administration is doing to help predominant Latino communities. La Maestra Community Health Centers opened up a new clinic here in El Cajon today. More on that in just a moment, but really the goal I'm told is to reduce health care costs and improve access to care for our underserved or ethnically diverse communities. Okay, yay. Today is really an awesome day. This is our 22nd licensed site. La Maestra says this new clinic will expand access to high quality primary and specialty care, as well as social and behavioral services. We also do immigration assistance, human trafficking assistance, youth development. We have a food pantry. For decades, their focus has been on people who are either low income or don't have any insurance at all. For example, they serve a large portion of our immigrant, refugee and homeless population. Last year, clinic data showed 77% of patients identify as a racial or ethnic minority. So with communication sometimes being a hindrance to care, they pride themselves on providing services in 60 different languages. We can be the medical home for populations that are in need. And that's our mission is to help people achieve well-being. This new and improved center will be life-changing for alcohol. U.S. Representative Sarah Jacobs helped secure funding for this clinic. The U.S. could save $67 billion every year if everyone used a primary care provider as their principal source of care. A lot of this will be the same focus of the Latino health tour. Health and Human Services Secretary Javier Becerra kicked it off this week in Florida and will be at San Diego State tomorrow. Becerra says the Biden administration is committed to improving the lives of Latinos and all who are underserved. One idea is to expand access and equity in clinical trials because right now cancer is the leading cause of death among Hispanic Americans. And tomorrow's meeting is not open to the public, but you can count on us to be there. Reporting in El Cajon, I'm Jenny Day for CBS 8. Thanks, Jenny.